Now the paragraph for question number 53 and 54. A box B1 contains one white, three red and two black balls. Another box B2 contains two white, three red and four black balls. A third box B3 contains three white, four red and five black balls. Let us talk about the first question that is 53rd first. If one ball is drawn from each of the three boxes B1, B2 and B3, the probability that all three drawn balls are of same color is the probability that all drawn balls are of same color. So, let us write the configuration first that the balls are in different boxes B1. Box B1 has one white, three red and two black balls. Box B2. Box B2 contains two white, three red and four black balls. Box B3 contains three white, four red and five black balls. Now the required probability that is the probability all three are of same color. It is possible the required probability. is equal to all three are white, all three are black or all three are red. Now all three are white means white from the first box total number of balls in box 1 it is 6, box 2 it is 9, box 3 it is 12. Correct. Now getting all three white balls the probability will be 1 by 6, 2 by 9, 3 by 12 or 3 by 6, 3 by 9, 4 by 12 or 2 by 6, 4 by 9, 5 by 12. Correct. So, this is the required probability which can be simplified as 6, 36 and 40 divided by total in denominator that is simply 648. We can cross check it simply that is 6, 12, 3 is a 36 here and 40 the third one divided by this is 12, 9 is a 108, 6 times 648. So, finally, we obtain this one as 82 divided by 648. So, the correct answer for this question is 82 upon 648 that is option A. So, the correct answer is A. Correct. Now, let us move to the next question of this paragraph which was for 53 and 54. We discussed the 53rd. Let us talk about the 54th question now. Okay, question number 54 for the same paragraph. If two balls are drawn without replacement from a randomly selected box and one of the balls is white and the other ball is red, the probability that these two balls are drawn from box B2 is four options are given then. So, the question is actually now talking about the Bayes theorem. So, let us write the configuration again from the given data of the paragraph box 1 that is 1 white, 3 red, 2 black. Total number of balls were 6, box 2, 2 white, 3 red and 4 black balls. Total number of balls 9, box 3, 3 white, 4 red and 5 black total number of balls 12. Question is talking about find the probability that let us read the statement again. The probability that these two balls are drawn from box B2. So, we have to find the probability that balls are drawn from box B2 and what are the balls? Balls are of the type one is white and other is red. So, probability B2 by white red this is simply equal to probability white red from B2 
into probability of getting from back B2 divided by we can put the summation sign or can write all three probability from B1 white rate from B1 plus probability of B2 white red from B2 plus probability of B3 white red from B3. Simply substitute this data, we get it as probability of getting box 2 that is simply probability of getting box 2 that is simply 1 by 3 correct 1 by 3 next white and red from box 2 box 2 means 2 c 1 into this is white 3 c 1 divided by 9 c 2 whole divided by probability of box b 1 1 by 3 multiplied with white red from box 1 1 c 1 3 c 1 upon 9 c 2 plus 1 by 3 into 2 c 1 3 c 1 upon 9 c 2 plus 1 by 3 multiplied with third box white red 3 c 1 4 c 1 upon 9 c 2 just simplify this data 9 c 2 can simply be cancelled 3 of denominator can also be cancelled out just simplify and that gives me the answer as 55 upon 181 that is the correct answer option number D. Correct. So, in this manner we get the solution for this question also. So, now move to the next question that is question number 55. 